What's going on YouTube? How's it going on? Welcome on back to the channel. We've got a couple hours left of the faction blessing this week, so I'm jumping back in with my Boreas Hex Sharpshooter deck, guys, because it has been proving me strong. It's been proving me well, so we probably should get a couple of units on the field, and it's a little bit unfortunate we're dropping a couple of hexes there, guys, but we've come up against a robot deck today. We've come up against a Max Priestess deck. He is running Trickster. Is he actually there? We go. I was going to say, is he actually going to be dropping anything today? But he does go ahead and drop something there, so we're looking good. We're in for a game now. Let's hope he can get his robot set up, and we're going to be doing absolute bits today. We, again, you've seen the deck, you know how it works. We're trying to get plenty of Boreas around Hexes, so they're doing plenty of in-skill damage. And we're trying to get some nice high-level sharpshooters and a nice high merge chemist. So they're actually doing work against the bosses. They're insta-killing things all over the place. We've got some nice talents on our sharpshooter. He's got some nice talents on his priestess. Let's hope that we're in for a good game, ladies and gentlemen. And here we go. How are you all doing though? I hope you're all doing really well. Have you made use of the Faction Blessing last week? Because by the time you are seeing this, the Faction Blessing will be over and it'll be something completely different. So we'll be seeing that together. We'll be making a video on that and we'll be finding out what is going on with that though, guys. Whoa, another hex there. We're going to be merging that one up now. We get another nice merge to Boreas there. So that one should be doing work for us. We'll be keeping our wave back a little bit better than what our wave has been doing so far. Insta-kill starting to kick in there. That's lovely. Obviously, his trickster is taking a little bit of mana off us, which is a bit unfortunate there, guys. But we're going to be keeping our wave back very, very, very nicely now. We've got a couple of levels on our Boreas there, so that's even better for us. We're going to be making sure that we're taking everything right on out, guys. Yes, we are. I really, really do. Like I said in the previous video again, guys, I can't thank you all enough for 800 subscribers, guys. I'm so happy. I'm ecstatic, guys. We just keep on growing. It's so, so good. And if you are enjoying all the videos, guys, make sure you are leaving a like on them, guys. Make sure you know, I know, that we're all enjoying them. And hopefully you guys are hitting that big red subscribe button. Hopefully you're coming to join the family, the big Rush Royale family, guys, that we are building over here. We're building a community. And again, like I said before, guys, you can come over and find us over in the Discord server, the Co-op Arcade. There will be a link in the description. Don't worry about that guys i'll leave it in there for you to find and there we go we're getting nicely set up now guys we've got some sharpshooters they're all leveling now nicely unfortunately we've got two merged two chemists but i'm sure we'll be able to get rid of one of them at some point guys we're not worried about that that boreas has just been merged up and we're taking our puppeteer out very quickly there sending that stun right on over which is obviously going to be causing a bit of damage to him and that's what we like to see guys that is absolutely gorgeous he's slowly but surely getting set up he needs to keep on merging keep getting things on the board then Priestess is going to be doing absolute work for them. Obviously, every time he does merge them, drop one, anything like that, they are going into an extra attack damage mode. So they're getting a bit of area attack, a bit of extra damage. 500% extra damage, actually, guys. It's not a bit of extra damage. It's absolutely humongous extra bits of damage. But we just got to merge three Boreas there. So we're going to have merge up that hex that is above it there we go don't know why i was forgetting the name there one of my favorite units and we are forgetting the name of there i do apologize hex but there we go we're looking good we're looking very nice now puppeteer coming out again still should we move me about guys we should still be able to take him out before he even touches us which will be very very nice oh i can't can't wait to see where this game goes guy i that was a bit of a tongue twister i can't wait to see where this game goes guys all right there we go finally getting my words out but robot very interesting to see he's got no talents on it though so that is very interesting as well guys we won't have to worry about them rockets coming flying on over but that's a way unfortunate we've just got ourselves a merge three hex there which is not going to be good for us we want to be trying to get rid of the merge two if potentially if possible we'll try and get rid of that merge two keep the merge three and then maybe try and get another hex somewhere else and don't want to ruin my board too much. Obviously, we are doing bits. We're keeping my wave back nicely. We've just lost a couple of sharpshooters there, which is a little bit unfortunate. But all of our Boreas are looking beautiful, guys. We're keeping our wave back very nicely now. We could do with getting a couple of levels on things. So there we go. We've got a couple of levels on our Boreas and our sharpshooter there. We could do with also getting one with our chemist. And maybe potentially trying to get one on our hex. But obviously, Puppeteer is coming in now. So it's maybe another one on my chemist. Yeah, let's do that. And there we go. Let's see how quick we take Puppeteer out. Oh, yes. No problem at all. Sending them sharpshooter stuns right on over, which is obviously going to do a bit of damage to him once again. And he's got no levels on his units. Anyway, guys, what's he doing? He's just... Is he waiting to put all of his units, all of his levels? Is he saving his mana? He's obviously a very mana conscious deck. He has to use loads of mana to try and get up to his merges. But he's looking good, guys. He's up to 17 now. Them robots are looking very strong. Very strong indeed. But we need to keep concentrating on our board. Obviously, it's fairly empty right now. We want to still try and get rid of that merge 2 hex that is up there. We want to try and keep the merge 3. The merge 2 on the left-hand side will be beautiful. It's still doing bits for us. But we need to make sure that we are keeping it on back. Keeping it on back. Come on. I can't wait to tear this man's robot apart, ladies and gentlemen. I can't wait to tear it apart. I really, really... Oh, that's another hex. Nothing I can really do with that, though, unfortunately. Um, we're going to have to merge off two of the merge one. Chemists. 
Oh, it just leveled up. We've just got another hex in that corner. Oh my goodness, what is going on with my board? Stop doing it to me like this. We're going to level up that shot shooting. Oh my god, that's another hex. How can it be doing it to me like this? That's a four. What's it doing to me? No thanks. Don't mind me. I'ma just grab my stuff and leave. Oh my goodness, we need to do something now. We really need to do something. There's another hex. Let's merge them up. That's a boring ass there. We've still got plenty of inks to kill on the board, guys. There is loads of hex. There's loads of inks to kill. But oh my goodness, we need to be actually getting rid of a couple of them hexes. That is ridiculous. We do not need all of them right now. Leveling up that chemist there. We could actually potentially level up that chemist again, guys. Or we could level up that hex. Get that merge over there. And it's oh my goodness, the merge four dryad. What are we doing with that? What are we doing with the merge four dryad? 243k there. We're going to be taking this Warlock out fairly quickly. I'm still taking him on out very quickly there. That's very, very, very nice. Puppeteer next. He could potentially move us about. It depends on how much our board's going to start filling up because obviously we are going to start losing a little bit of damage against them mini bosses. But that level up on our chemist was absolutely beautiful, guys. He's going to help us right on back. All right, we need. I need. What? What is it? I need a hex where that dryad has just dropped, guys. That's where I could do with a hex. But let's just go ahead and shut that dryad on there just so it's a little bit more damage. It is on a merge for hex after all, guys. It's going to be doing absolute work against them mini, mini owns. And there we go. We get that boss taken out. And look, we're keeping that wave right on back, guys. Well, once it kicks in, we're keeping that wave right on back. There we go. Putting another level on that Boreas there. And we're getting a sharpshooter down there. We're going to merge them up. And yes, we finally do get that Hex. So that's back on that Boreas. We're going to make sure we get that Boreas straight on to a merge 5. And there we go, guys. We're going to cause absolute destruction. Now we're going to be making sure we keep our wave right on back. And we probably are going to be getting moved by Puppeteer. But oh well, ladies and gentlemen. It really doesn't matter. As long as that merge 5 stays on that Hex, I'm not bothered one little bit. Because his insta-kill is insane right now, ladies and gentlemen. Absolutely insane. This deck is unbelievable, guys. Bit unfortunate that obviously the faction blessing is going to come to an end in a couple of hours for me, but maybe we could make it work in a normal PvP match without the faction blessing. We'll have to wait and see. We maybe we could chuck a scrapper in here instead of a dryad, and then obviously get merged up, and then make sure we have a scrapper start eating things. We'll have to wait and see, ladies and gentlemen, because obviously, hopefully, we're going to be able to use scrapper again next week. Because obviously, this week has been very, very, very annoying to be using scrapper, getting leveled up every 60 seconds. But there we go, we're looking good guys, we're looking very nice now, you can see we've got plenty of Boreas on the board, plenty of them are touching hexes, they're keeping everything right on back. And we aren't even struggling against them mini bosses guys, you can see we're keeping everything right on back very nicely, we've got another merge one down there, so I think we might chuck that dryad on there, just so we're potentially getting a little bit more damage off against these bosses, we'll potentially take them out a little bit quicker. Uh, that's another merge three, we're going to get them two merged off now, that's a merge three dryad which isn't too bad for us, we're going to rock our snowflake. Oh my god, this one's so close. Oh my god, he's not he's keeping himself in it. No, and there we go. We're taking our boss out, so we are going to be keeping our wave right on back now with that insta-kill, and that kept us in it. Oh my goodness, guys. I can't believe I'll get the win there. That was absolutely insane. 51 million damage. That can't believe that that was absolutely amazing that's put us right into the next league as well what a dub ladies and gentlemen what a dub i can't believe we got that win guys that was absolutely insane against robot there and the max level priestess that is going to be the end of this video though guys and if you have enjoyed it please do go down and leave a like make sure you are subscribing if you are new around here like i said guys come and join the family and for now guys this has been your boy cedric i'll see you in the next one peace